Hey, what's up everybody? This is Alex from Not Casuals, and today we are going to be playing the Elder Scrolls Skyrim and we will be showing you how to get married in the game. So first step, we have to be in Dragon Breach and go uh, buy a house from uh, this dude because this is the cheapest house in the game. 5,000 gold. Once we have the house, we have to head to Riften. Alright, now that we are in Riften, we have to head over to the Inn, the B and Barb, I believe. Once we are inside, we speak to Maramal and we tell him that we want to know about the Temple of Mara. Uh, the goal of this is to be able to buy an amulet of Mara that will cost uh, 200 gold. Cool story, bro. Alright, now that he sold you the amulet, we can go back to uh, Whiterun. Alright, so the first thing we want to do is equip the amulet of Mara. So that's going to trigger a different uh, quest plot in uh, the NPC you chose. Uh, also keep in mind that there is more than one girl available. There will be a full list of the girls available in the description box. Or males for if you play a girl. Alright, so uh, I chose Isolda because uh, before you are able to um, get married, you will have to complete at least one quest for your, uh, your future spouse. And uh, her quest is pretty easy. You just have to bring her a mammoth desk. So. Enter and then you just tell her that you're interested, exactly. vice versa, blah blah blah, and then you head back to Riften. Alright, now that we are back in Riften, we have to head back to the Temple of Mara and proceed with the wedding um, ceremony. Once we are inside, we simply speak with Maramal. I said speak with Maramal. <laughs> Anytime you want to have a wedding. I so you basically have to come back here like 20 hours later or something. Alright, so now that the wedding is starting because we waited 20 hours. <coughs> Show up here. Ah, here's the blushing bride now. Let's begin the ceremony. It was Mara that first gave birth to all of creation and pledged to watch over us as her children. It is from her love of us that we first learned to love one another. It is from this love that we learned that life lived alone is no life at all. We gather here today under Mara's loving gaze to bear witness to the union of two souls in eternal companionship. May they journey forth together in this life and in the next, in prosperity and poverty, and in joy and hardship. Do you agree to be bound together in love, now and forever? I do. Now and forever. Do you agree to be bound together? I do. Now and forever. Alright, now speak with your wife before she exits. And uh, tell her that she can live in your house. And then we can exit this place. Alright, keep in mind that if you want, you can uh, marry the same sex. If it it's up to you really and um when the some of the benefits of having a wife uh, she will open a shop so, uh, so you tell her what she has for sale and she you can sell for like 750 gold to her which is an extra vendor always good thing um, she will make some profit and give you a hundred gold per day that you are away so a thousand gold if you're away for 10 days and she can cook you stuff it's like a small food buff also if you sleep next to your spouse uh, you will get the lover stone bonus uh, it's like 15% uh, quicker learning abilities. Also, if you want to um, tell your wife to go live into a different house, you can. You just tell her to go live in your house in Windhelm or whatever, or Solitude, whichever you have and stuff. So, that's pretty cool. Thanks for watching, guys. This was Alex from Not Casuals. And if you liked the video, make sure to leave a comment and subscribe. Thank you.